Hey everybody and welcome back to another Aviary Birds & Co video. Uh, if you haven't done so already, please subscribe. Uh, we do post new videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. We do focus on aviary birds, uh, New Zealand rabbits, uh, some aquatics, and uh, uh, some reptiles here every now and then. So this video is going to be uh, an update on our red New Zealands. So this is the end of March, uh, so we're going to highlight a couple of our litters here. So the buck you're sitting, you're seeing here is one of our newest pickups. So his name is JG. He is um, a recent pickup. We picked them up from a well-known breeder in our area. So I did pick him up from Manuel Hidalgo. Uh, he is a California breeder here, a couple hours away from my location. So he does breed show quality bucks. Um, and as you can tell, this guy has a nice arch um, to his, his structure here. He is solid. So if you look at him and especially put your hands on him uh, as I am here, he is solid. He is <clears throat> meaty. He might be a little wide, but if you look at his loin there, he um, he's pretty good. So now let's take a look at our does here. So this is my doe Hermione. She kindled approximately 14 days ago. So Hermione is not pedigreed. Uh, so these kits will not be pedigreed, but Hermione is one of my best does and she is one of my friendliest does. So she had seven kits here. Uh, so she, she had seven, she raised all seven. They are about two weeks, 14, 15 days or so. <clears throat> and I will be keeping one of these does. Like I said, Hermione is super friendly uh, and I'm hoping to, to get pedigreed lines from her. Um, or at least start a pedigree land from her. Uh, so all of Hidalgo's uh, books are pedigreed. So these guys are partially pedigreed. And hopefully in the future I can uh, start getting my, my own line traced back to Hermione here. Uh, they're super cute, super uh, adorable as all rabbits are. And their coloration is, is um, pretty spot on as well. I am going to go for more of the show quality little darker red. So I'll be selective breeding for a little dark red more show structured rabbits and you can see like i said hermione is one of my more uh, friendlier ones so this is the second doe with the same litter from jg uh, she is zr34 i picked her up from a breeder um, in my area as well about an hour away she's not as friendly um, but she is still she has a nice structure to her and she uh, uh had a nice little litter as well so these kits are only about seven days older so so they haven't even opened their eyes yet she did have eight rabbits or eight bunnies however you want to call it whether you're a rabbit or a bunny person so she had eight unfortunately we did lose the runt uh, the runt was fairly small so she currently only has um seven kits in here right now and from what from they're sired by the same bug but two different does and from what i can tell there is going to be a difference as you can see from here her, her kits here, um, a little bit more on the smaller side, but they look like they're going to be a little bit more solid. You can see they have a lot of uh, uh, wrinkles to them, a little um, Sharpay-ish if you're, if you're familiar with that dog breed. So I'm definitely excited between the two. Uh, depending on how that last letter turns out, I might keep a buck from there as a um, safety. But that'll do it for now. If you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe. Um, like the like the video and then check out our website aviarybirdsandco.com if you're interested in any rabbits this is where i'll post them and i also have a couple of uh, articles up there so I'll catch you guys on the next one